Ever felt dizzy after standing up too quickly? Or maybe you've been told your blood pressure is on the lower side during a routine checkup. I'm going to delve into why your blood pressure might be lower than usual and what that means for your health. Let's unveil the secrets behind low blood pressure. Blood pressure, the force of your blood pushing against the walls of your blood vessels, is crucial for getting oxygen and nutrients around your body. But what happens when this pressure goes lower than what's considered normal? First off, let's define low. Typically, doctors consider a blood pressure reading under 90, 60, and MHG as low. But remember, what's low for others might be normal for you if you're not experiencing any symptoms. So, why might your blood pressure be low? There are several reasons, and they range from benign to serious. Let's break them down. One common cause is dehydration. When your body loses more water than it takes in, your blood volume decreases, and so does your blood pressure. This could be due to excessive sweating, severe diarrhea, or not drinking enough fluids. Another reason could be heart issues. If your heart isn't pumping efficiently, it can lower the pressure of the blood flowing through your arteries. Conditions like a low heart rate, heart valve problems, or heart failure can all contribute to this. Next up, endocrine problems. Disorders like adrenal insufficiency or severe hypothyroidism can severely affect your blood pressure. Medications are also a usual suspect. Drugs for high blood pressure, diuretics, and certain types of antidepressants can cause your blood pressure to drop. If you've started a new medication and notice symptoms of low blood pressure, it's crucial to consult your healthcare provider. And then, there are more acute causes like severe infections or allergic reactions, which can lead to a life-threatening condition called shock, drastically dropping your blood pressure. But let's not forget about the less tangible factors. For instance, your diet plays a role. A lack of vitamins B12 and folate can prevent your body from producing enough red blood cells, leading to anemia and low blood pressure. Now, if you're experiencing symptoms like dizziness, fainting, blurred vision, or fatigue, it's important to see a doctor to figure out the cause. Treatment for low blood pressure depends on the underlying issue. It might be as simple as adjusting your diet, hydrating more, or changing medications or it could require more specific treatments if it's due to a heart condition or other severe disorders. Understanding the cause is your first step towards managing and improving your health. Remember, knowledge is power, and knowing why your blood pressure might be low is key to taking the right steps to maintain your well-being. Thanks for tuning in, and make sure to take care of your health.